and today is the first in a series looking at the plan ahead pantry and the first part of that is finding some store cupboard recipes that we love and can have right to hand for those tough times when life goes a little bit pear-shaped so if you've not done this kind of food planning before you might want to subscribe because over the next few months we're going to be working on how to get a well-stocked pantry whether that's the pantry like today which is our store cupboard whether it's what we're growing so the outdoor pantry or whether it's stuff that we've got in the freezer the cold pantry so let's show you one of my favorite dishes which works really well as a store cupboard recipe so what I'm cooking today then is linguine puttanesca so here's what you need some anchovy fillets so you could use canned anchovy I'm using salted anchovy fillets in olive oil here but it doesn't matter just some kind of anchovies with a long shelf life you'll need some red pepper flakes some capers, these are capers in brine, again, very long shelf life. You will need some olives. You can use whichever olives you like for this. It's traditionally made with black olives, but I quite like green olives, so you choose. You'll need some garlic. Now, garlic lasts a very long time in the cupboards if you store it in a dark place and with a stable, cool temperature. But if you don't have any garlic in the cupboards, you can substitute garlic salt instead. You'll need some oil to cook in. So so hopefully you've always got some oil or whatever you cook with in the cupboards. I like olive oil. You will need a can of tomatoes or some passata for this dish. Again, shelf stable. And finally, you will need your linguine or whatever kind of pasta or spaghetti that you like. And that's it. That's all you need for the basics of this dish. And at the end, I'll give you a couple of optional extra ingredients that you can use if you happen to have them in. But if not, this makes a delicious meal and it's super simple and quick to do. So we'll start by putting on a pan of boiling water for the pasta and then off we go. And this will be cooked really quickly. That is all of the prep you need. So the pasta's on, and now we just need to cook up our sauce. So let's cut our pan on, and we'll start with our generous glug of olive oil, or your oil of choice. And then we'll put in the garlic. And we'll just get the garlic to a bit of golden brown. Because that's beginning to color. We add in the anchovies, the olives, and the capers. The chilies. And then we just add in the tomatoes. So just let that cook down. This cooks down in the length of the time it takes for your linguine or spaghetti to cook. So that's nicely cooked down now. So all we have to do is drain the pasta. Add it to the sauce. And let all that beautiful, flavoursome sauce coat your pasta. And there you have a really fiery, beautiful pasta dish, which will help cheer you up on the worst of evenings. So let's serve it up and taste it. That is beautiful just as it is. 
but if you happen to have a little bit of parsley growing on your windowsill, flat leaf parsley is a wonderful accompaniment to this because it really stands up to the robust flavours. So here it is, let's have a taste, cheers. That's absolutely delicious. So that is one of my store cupboard favourites. So I hope this might become one of your pantry favourites. But if it doesn't, I'm going to be doing some more videos on similar recipes using store cupboard ingredients. So don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you at the next one. Thank you.